Hello, happy Monday. It's a new fresh week and it's a brand new video. This is one of my favorite videos to film. It's just a classic week in my life. I did these all the time in high school and I did a whole bunch freshman year. So I'm gonna ramp them up and start doing more because usually my vlogs are a couple days in a row, but I just love showing the whole week and I know you guys are loving the longer videos. So welcome to the week in my life. This is a really exciting week because we have Big Little. The reveal is tomorrow. The girls have already gotten their two, their first two baskets and today is the third basket. I need to put this one out in the living room in like five minutes. So I'm finishing up super fast. I had two classes this morning, my lab and my writing class, and then the third one got canceled. Love that. And Riley is my little, she doesn't know it yet. I mean, she kind of does, but I've been trying to throw her off with hints. I'm still obsessed with my haircut. I finally got my dead ends trimmed off and I just feel like it made such a world of a difference. It's definitely a little bit shorter. I think I notice it more because I'm always looking at myself and always looking at videos of myself when I edit. It really did make a big difference. I'm gonna get back to the basket in one second, but it's a very typical rest of the day. I need to go eat lunch, and then I signed up for a 12.45 core power class. We got back from camping yesterday, and usually I've been working out in the morning because I just am much more motivated first thing than after I go to my classes, but I was like, I just need to sleep, especially having the 8 a.m. lab this morning because the camping trip it was really fun. Don't get me wrong, but it really took it out of me. I felt like I needed to stare at a wall. I don't want to complain because we really did have a good time. It was just freezing cold at night, but I needed like to decompress after we got back. It was like a two hour drive. The place we stayed was gorgeous. It was Stillwater Campground in Granby, Colorado. Beautiful, but I woke up and I'm not kidding. It was 27 degrees. My car temperature said it was 27 degrees. I just don't think I was fully prepared. Anyway, I'm gonna go to the core power class and then just kind of chill, get work done for the rest of the afternoon and then chapter and young life tonight. So it's a very, classic busy Monday and tomorrow night like I was saying we have big little reveal so every year we do dynamic duos so some girls get really funny and creative with it and I don't know I need to look back at the document to see what everyone's doing but I'm gonna do Deion Sanders and my little is gonna be Shadur Sanders our football coach and our quarterback I just went to the bookstore and I bought the rest of the accessories for our costumes. I ordered this, I need to go get it, it's downstairs. I ordered this shiny watch because Shadur Sanders, like his signature thing is going like this with his watch and he has that dumb song, Perfect Timing. So I'm gonna play the song, Perfect Timing, and then I'm gonna come out and then the reveal will happen. I'll vlog tomorrow so you guys can see, but I bought this, which I'm gonna give to her to keep. And then these two things I'm gonna try to return because they were not cheap. And I'm only gonna be wearing this for like 10 minutes probably waiting for the reveal. She's gonna wear this, so I'm gonna put this in her basket and tell her to leave the tag on. I have to be really careful not to get this dirty, but it's like the full on prime <laughs> jacket with the signature and I'm gonna wear Casey's black cowboy hat. It's, where did I put it? Okay, this hat <laughs> with sunglasses. I think Ryan's boyfriend has like the actual prime blender, so I'm gonna borrow those and then wear the hoodie with a vest and leggings. So I'm gonna have like the full get up and she'll be in the Thing. I told her to put like game day eye black on her face and then wear the watch in this letter. What else did I say? I was making puns with all the Shadur like Dion quotes. I just don't want to open it because it's already sealed. And then our theme for today's basket is DG merch. So I filled this up with all kinds of stuff. Here it is. It's so obnoxious. This is awesome. So great, okay. She's gonna be like, what the heck is this? This box is so massive because I also ordered a refill on my stain remover. I stain everything so I go through it so fast. Oh, it's bubbling. The bubble just keeps getting bigger. This stuff is great because it's non-toxic and it actually works really well. All right, there are baskets everywhere, all over the living room. So many baskets. We're having BLTs for lunch. I'm just not the biggest BLT girl, so I made a chicken salad and I'm having pasta salad. Papa's calling me. Hi, Papa. I heard you threw your butt off. Oh, I was so cold. It was crazy. Did you get my voicemail? You're more the Hilton type, right? Yes, I said I'm more of a glamper. Yeah. Instead of a camper. You haven't plugged out yet, huh? No, I haven't plugged out yet. Can you believe it? It's like you're on a holiday or something. <laughs> I know, it's like I'm on holiday. I feel like the day has fully gotten away from me. I've been reapplying Aquaphor and this stuff 
all day because my lips are so chapped from camping i'm out running errands right now i feel like i've had brain fog all day like i haven't been able to get anything done i really don't know i'm just like having one of those days where i feel so tired and just out of it i just got off the phone with papa and he's really excited because i'm going home this weekend again for the penn state usc game i need to buy a new suitcase because my suitcase is broken the handle is stuck and will not go down it takes a good five minutes to get the handle down and it just i opened up the inside my dad tried to fix it papa tried to fix it matt tried to fix it they all were like oh i could fix this and then it's just stuck and caught and it takes like a good five minutes of wiggling it around to get the handle to go down you should have seen me on the plane because i had to put it in the overhead bin anyway i need to get a new suitcase and i also want to get my car washed because it's so dirty from camping it just was parked in the dirt so like these are not things that i have to do right now but i was like i can no longer sit here and look at my computer and i need to do something productive so might as well run the errands usually home goods is not the place that i find luggage typically but i looked it up and it said they do online so hopefully do you guys have to have luggage no at all okay thank you they don't have luggage that don't lie to me i should have called i don't know what i was thinking the pledges are singing to us in the courtyard <laughs> we're having full court we are back home and we're downstairs which can only mean one thing actually it can mean a lot of things but in this case it means it's time to get stuff done I'm Chelsea. I'm Lily. I'm so excited. I'm Liv. I'm Courtney. Katie is the best. And you guys know. The go. Katie, I have that phone. We're <laughs> looking for a movie to put on. You want an Abby cam? Yeah. I'm going to recommend them this necklace. It's from Amazon. Uh huh. And we can link it below. Yeah. And Perfect. it's really good. And I've gotten a lot of compliments on it. So you guys should all get it. But today, I went to Core Power. Love it. At 8 a.m., which I can never wake up for, but I did it today. And then I had class and I did my laundry. And then I sat right there on that couch for hours and did my homework. Oh, I have a funny story I can tell them. I texted my little off my phone because I didn't think she had my phone number. And I was like, hey, it's your big. Come pick up your baskets. She literally has my contact. So I gave it all away. And her anime costume isn't even here. It's so, an anime costume. Yes. And so everything's falling apart. But other than that, my day was great. Hey guys, okay, so basically today, I got my pledges, not my pledges, the Hi pledges. Hi vlog! <laughs> it's Reese's home! Yeah. So they gave birth. Well, can you explain what the I pledges are doing with so the they baskets? they deliver um, my littles baskets. When's this being posted? After tomorrow? Yeah, 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 yeah. Claire and Carrie, shout out my littles. Anyway, they just get really creative and funny. <laughs> Watch this, so they stop. What? Yeah. Stay committed. Really awesome. Mine saying Riley. Um, think of One Direction song. What did Annie bring home? Just all a bunch of old stuff. Are you giving these away? I don't know. You're keeping them all for yourself. Dude, I'm so jealous. It's so cute. that I make tea at night because I love it so much and it's like a reward. Obviously I had ice cream tonight too, do not get me wrong. This is not replace dessert, but something about a warm drink before bed is the coziest thing ever. Anyway, another Monday in the books. Today was kind of a weird day. It was just like mid. You know, I just feel like I wasn't as productive as I wanted to be. It was just like I was saying earlier, one of those days I have a friend who's walking through something really hard right now and I'm excited for a fresh start tomorrow morning. It's gonna be a great day. I don't have any class tomorrow. I'll explain why. It's just because my professors are out of town or not out of town. One of them is doing a presentation that he has to do during our class time and the other one is out of town and they both happen to be the classes that are on the same day. So I don't have class tomorrow, which is awesome i signed up for pilates in the morning to just get the day started early so i can be productive and then big little reveal is at seven also this is off topic but i don't know how i feel about my red nails i love them for fall but it doesn't even feel like fall here yet because it's still so hot it's gonna be 80 degrees again tomorrow 
but I don't think it really cooled down last October until at least halfway through so I feel like it's not out of the ordinary do you see my hair right now usually I only do this hairstyle when I'm not filming because it's just wildly unflattering but I really need my hair out of my face what was I saying Oh, my nails. I just, I think they're a little too much for me because usually I go for very neutral nails and I love that with neutral nails I can feel like my nails always match my outfit and it's always put together-ish. I don't know. Very much first world problems. Also still going strong with the scar cream. In case you're new, I literally fell flat on my chin walking to class the week before recruitment and i had to get some stitches in my chin it's all healed now all the stitches are gone but i'm trying to be very religious about this scar cream last but not least i'm gonna do 1500 layers of this this off before it has seen better days it's literally disappearing and i'm gonna top it off with the tatcha lip mask because my lips are like peeling they're so chapped which worries me for winter. I'm gonna have to break back out that thick La Roche Posay moisturizer. I was not prepared for it last year because I've obviously had never lived in Colorado before moving here for college. And the moisturizer that I'm talking about just saved my skin because it just got so dry when it started to get really cold. This is the stuff. It's magical in the winter. Okay, that's all for me for today. It's almost midnight, so I need to get in bed. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys. I'm back from Pilates. It was killer. Like my legs were completely on fire, but I'm back. I didn't vlog early this morning because I was in a big rush getting out of the house because I woke up late, but I got a full like seven and a half hours of sleep, which is good for me. I'm literally shaking the camera because my arm is still shaking, but I set out two outfit options yesterday. I didn't know if I was going to be feeling more athleisure or more put together. I think I'm going to go with this because I have a lot to do. And when I feel more put together, usually it goes well. <laughs> I'm just doing light makeup because I'm probably gonna redo my makeup later and just put more on. I really need to take advantage of the fact that I don't have class today. I have ads to film. It's a very balanced day, like in terms of school, social life, and then work, like actual YouTube work. I feel like I have an even amount of time for all those things. So I'm just gonna be working away. I'm gonna go to a coffee shop with Annie. I think she's class at like noon, but I'll probably stay there. I don't even know how long and just get all the computer stuff out of the way first. I'm going to my favorite coffee shop and they have the best avocado toast. So I'm gonna get that and make a protein smoothie in here because this was PR and I also got sent protein powder from Truvani so I'm gonna make a little protein shake to go take it with me and then get the avocado toast at the coffee shop and I'm gonna wear my bow earrings today all right it's 9 53 so very much time to get the day started Okay, this is delish. And the fact that I can just drink it out of the blender is so awesome. My mom used to say every morning when we were eating breakfast, like in elementary school, this is the day, the whoa, I just tripped on a rock. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. <laughs> We're back at the house. Me and Charlotte have to record this like 20 minute Zoom conversation for our online class. We really have no idea what we're doing, but yeah. I got lunch. lunch today. We're having deli sliders. And I also got some of this orzo salad situation. Fire. We're having taco bowls for dinner and cupcakes. <laughs> oh shoot. I've been editing away. I just had dinner. Those taco bowls were so good. Literally. Phenomenal. It's like the best chicken we've ever had in the house. And my Amazon packages arrived. Got a new pack of Element Electrolytes. This new makeup bag I was talking about earlier. And my suitcase. I was conflicted about the suitcase thing because I was thinking of ordering a nice one from like Base or Away or CalPak. One of those really nice brands. But they were literally two, upwards of $200. And I was like, I'm a college student. I know this luggage is going to get like messed up. It's not going to stay nice. So... I'll just wait to get the nice luggage till I'm out of college or like ask for it for Christmas or something. I'm getting a call. It's probably Casey. Hi, I'm coming right now. I'll come downstairs. Okay, we're, we're in by my car. Okay, okay bye.
Anyway, really fast, I got this on Amazon. It was under 50 bucks from Wrangler. It's a little bit smaller than the one I had before. It was a Calpac one that I like luckily found at TJ Maxx for cheap. This will do the trick. I don't need anything super fancy. And I'm thinking I'll maybe invest in like a nicer carry-on bag. So I always wear my backpack, but I love the Weekender bags from Base. So if anybody has like a good carry-on personal item recommendation or if you have the Base Weekender, all my friends that have it love it, but. Anyway, I'm gonna go. We're running really quick to Ryan's boyfriend's house to grab the sunglasses I was talking about the other day. Vamanos. California though, right? We got the goods. How great are these? I'm so excited. You guys have to see Casey. She's in a bright blonde wig because she's Hannah Montana. It's like the best thing I've ever seen. This is the best part of living in a sorority house and everyone's just running around getting ready for stuff. It's so fun. It feels like, honestly, kind of like I'm back in high school. And I have all my friends over to get ready. <laughs> Wait, I have to put them down. And you have to turn around and show the tail. It's so great. And her littles are bananas. Yes. Look at this thing. <laughs> mer, mer, mer. I feel like this, these pieces didn't straighten properly. You think I can like bring my computer down there to work while I wait? Like, where's the line gonna go? Up the stairs? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this! I didn't even recognize you. This is so awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You get the best of both worlds. You need a microphone. I know. I should have gotten one. <laughs> I first walked in and I just burst out laughing. Unreal. I'm just not a blonde. No, but that's okay. Also, this is such a brassy blonde color. It's like really yellow. I'm Cruella DeVille. I'm John Sullivan. Curious yeah. George. My little's a monkey. I love it. Daphne. My little is spread and we have a big family photo coming your way. I'm Zach and she's Cody. <laughs> Harry Potter, obviously. Amazing. Okay. So great. <laughs> this is Riley. She's the best ever and we're gonna have the most fun night of all time. So Thursday. It's almost 8.15. I slept in a little bit today because I was up late editing last night. I still have a little bit more to finish and then class at 9.30. I'm so excited though because tomorrow I go home and see my family and I see Matt. In case you missed my last video, I got a weighted stuffed animal and it's kind of changing my life. I got it at Target. I oiled my hair last night. I haven't oiled my hair in forever. I just really want to do a better job taking care of it since I just got that trim. And I'm going to try to see if I have time to wash it. I might just have to slick it back because I have an appointment for my chin at 11. So I need to recap yesterday for just really loud. Hold on. It's like a white noise machine over there. I figured a montage would suffice for yesterday's vlog because I was just on my computer. I didn't really think it would be a very interesting vlog to begin with. We had a workout class to start an event and then I went to Trader Joe's. But besides that, I was really just on my computer editing all day and filming a little bit for TikTok. And truth be told, <laughs> it's not like me confessing, but I always try to do the most and film things for both TikTok and YouTube. And I always hate how things turn out because it's like, how do I say this? Excuse my language, like half effort. That's a more classy way to say it. Also, I'm doing my skincare because I've accepted the fact that I will not have time to shower. So, I'll have to shower after my plastic surgery appointment. It's always half effort when I try to film things for both. So, I just was sticking to TikTok yesterday. I have two classes this morning. I'm gonna run to the coffee shop that Adeline works at before, grab a chai. And then the reason I have to go to the plastic surgery place, I really don't think it is, but I'm like better safe than sorry. I think this might be infected because it was like 
filling with stuff the other day. Sorry if that's gross and TMI. I'm just, I don't know. It really looks fine. It's just a little red. But I called them and they asked me what I fell on. And I was like, oh, it was sidewalk. It was like some uneven pavement. And she said, sometimes if, like, they do a good job cleaning it out at the emergency room. But, or they did a good job cleaning it out at the emergency room. But sometimes a rock can get stuck in there. And it can try to force its way out. And then, I don't know. Anyway, I'm sure it's fine. But, again, better safe than sorry. So I have that this morning and then I have a really exciting, very informal photo shoot later for something that's launching. I talked about this, oh my gosh, this has been in the works since, I wanna say February, and we finally have a launch date. So I just need to get a couple pictures taken and I'm hiring Ryan as my photographer. Like I said, it's very informal. I hate to be that person. I know that's the worst, but stay tuned okay i need to seriously get going because i have to finish this video i left like 20 minutes of footage to edit because i was so tired last night i was like i need to go to bed i'm gonna do these pumpkin overnight oats for breakfast Cut it out. I'm not gonna change because I'm only gonna have this on for the next few hours. Going with the raspberry salt electrolyte today. Our house mom Barb tried these, the element packets. They're my favorite. I love them because they're not as sweet and I like the saltiness, but Barb said she wanted to gag when she tried them. I brought them up and she was like, <laughs> ready for the morning. I need to shake my armpits immediately. All the Halloween decorations are up around the house. Look what the barista just made me. Can you explain what this is? So what we have here is I just made a homemade apple cinnamon syrup. And I like boiled apples and then you add brown sugar and cinnamon sticks. And then it's chai, only one shot of espresso because Katie doesn't really like coffee, but I'm trying to get her to like it a little more. And then wow. Okay, do taste test. Okay. Computer. Oh my gosh, that is so good. <laughs> I wish you guys could try. If any of you guys see this, please come visit me at Moxie. She'll make you a... Free drinks. Apple, cinnamon, chai, Even though I should be charging dirty chai. <laughs> Don't expose me. I act like this is like my own coffee shop here. <laughs> I'm like, sure. I know you made this. I'm like, take whatever. You, did you like boil it in the back? I just grabbed a pot from the back. <laughs> And I was like, can I use seven of these apples? And I cut all of them in. But the people love it. So yeah. now I want to make a pumpkin one. But you should. Yeah. What can't she right. do? She ran a marathon the other weekend. I did. It's crazy. I'm still hurting. Grammy. Still hurting. Grandma can't run like that no more. <laughs> it's a little later. I'm back from the doctor. And my chin is just fine. Thank goodness. I think... Because I was using that scar cream, and I usually don't like switch out my skincare routine or anything, that area of my skin got irritated and a pimple was there, and that's what that was. Oh well, whatever it is, it's all good and healed, and I'm grateful that there's not an issue. I need to go shower and wash this oil out of my hair. It's literally been in here 12 hours now. And I know you're not supposed to leave it in that long, but it is what it is. Hi guys. I've been sitting in my towel waiting for the water to come back on, but I just don't think it's going to come back on any soon. Long story short, I like got myself all ready to take this shower. I finished up all my work for the day for the most part, besides like a couple things I can do later, like readings and things that really aren't imperative. And I'm like, I'm going to take the longest, most amazing shower, like shave everything, wash everything. I go to turn on the shower and nothing comes out of the shower head. And so I texted our house group chat. I was like, does anyone know what the heck is going on with the showers? And everyone's like, the basement's flooded. So I don't know when we're going to have the water back on, but like the toilets won't even flush. It's just a whole situation. But lucky for me, my friend Piper lives across the street. She's also a DG. So I'm just going to walk over to her house and shower. But I was like getting things sorted out. because I was like, I'm just going to be sitting here, I guess. And I actually am not going to do that photo shoot today. So like everything's kind of changing plans because i'm waiting for something else to arrive for the photo shoot that's arriving this weekend for some reason i thought it was coming today but i don't have to have everything done like the photos will have to be done until monday so i'm just gonna do it monday anyway i truly feel so disgusting because this oil has been in my hair for so long it is 
2.21 right now. I had lunch, it was great. Who knows if we're gonna have dinner because I don't know if they can do, even do the dishes. But since I'm not gonna do the photo shoot and I don't have a lot going on the rest of the day besides just packing for tomorrow, I have like a list of random things I've been wanting to do, like clean the makeup brushes. I've been meaning to put this protector spray on my new Uggs. I wanna tint my eyelashes. So it's just gonna be like a fun little self-care night. Sorry that this vlog is so not academic. I was planning on showing more of my classes and the academic side of things because it's more college focused, but you know, it is what it is. It's just not as busy of a week because we have midterms coming up in the next few weeks. I do have one exam on Friday, but it's all open notes. So I really don't have to study much for it. I just have to review the material. Tomorrow's Friday. What am I thinking? I need to review all the material tonight, but I'm just gonna have a nice chill rest of the day. Let's see what else is on my to-do list. Mostly just all the work that I would be doing this weekend. That way I can chill when I'm at home. That's pretty much it, which is rare because usually I'm like so go, 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 hyper doing a lot all the time, but not so much this week and I'll take it. I have one more thing to show you before I go. It's this face and neck massager. I would like, this looks like something you'd buy off an infomercial. Usually I'm not one to be convinced off of an Instagram ad to buy something, but I bought this off the Prime Day deal. And it has like red light therapy. That's the main reason I wanted it because I've heard such good things about that stuff. This contraption. I probably need to charge it. Oh wait, there we go. Anyway, I will use this after I get out of the shower because I don't really want to use it on my dirty skin. But I ordered that and I ordered this ice roller. This didn't take a lot of convincing for me to purchase because it was $4. I just wanted one that had a cap because I'm gonna put it in the communal fridge downstairs and just use it in the morning. Oh, it's double-sided. And I like that it has the ridges. Okay, reporting live from my bed. I cannot tell you the last time this happened. I'm not staying here, but I like am ready to go to bed at 8.30. But I still have some things I wanna do because I've just been laying around. I just had the yummiest snack ever. It's such a great fall snack. It's apples dipped in cookie butter and I bought Trader Joe's apples the other day. Their big Honeycrisp apples are just the best. Anyway, I don't know why the music stopped. It was just playing a second ago, but we actually have a mixer tonight that I'm not going to. So many of us aren't going because it's just midterm season and we had like our big night of the week. I feel like for DG Tuesday with Big Little. And you guys know me, I'm usually not one to go out more than one night a week, if that. I think it's just all the back-to-back -back travel and the lack of sleep is catching up to me. So it was nice to just have such a relaxing afternoon. I still need to spray my Uggs, but we're gonna go get Ryan because she has to work the mixer. Just, she has to clean up. Look at how awesome Barb looks. Woo! The Uggs have been sprayed and they are drying. Usually when we have mixers, all the boys come to us. <laughs> Stop, do not put your toes in. They all come to the house first and like pick us up and then everyone walks together, so. When they arrived, we played music, and that was what you were hearing. I just want to eat my pizza in peace without you asking for a bite every time. <laughs> She's like a to <laughs> She's like a toddler. I've been convinced to emerge from my rotting and go get ice cream. Okay, we're back and we're having a lash tinting party. Everyone's tinting their lashes because I accidentally ordered a third of these kits. I didn't realize I had two. I just completely forgot oh, so now we get to share in the morning i don't know if anyone can relate my lashes always get tangled when i sleep anyway this is what they look like it makes just the most subtle difference but i feel like it boosts my confidence so much and i really only wear mascara for special occasions i have my first class at nine my flight tonight doesn't leave till four o'clock so i have some time after to like pack and get everything sorted so I can come back on Sunday to a clean room. But I'm gonna get ready, go for a walk, and then head to class, and I have my exam after my first class. Someone commented asking for me to show more instead of talk about it, so I'm trying my best. I just love to yap at my desk sometimes. It's another gorgeous day in Boulder. Back home. Delish. Okay, it's officially 1.32. I finished all my work for the weekend, finished the exam. I got a 33 out of 36, so 
I'll take it. We're leaving for the airport in like 20 minutes. Lucky for me, Ryan and Casey are also going home. So Ryan's boyfriend is going to take all of us to the airport. Anyway, I have like 20 minutes. I'm so excited until we leave. Like I was saying, I need to get everything together still. I have it all like thrown on the ground. I just need to actually pack it up and then pick up the rest of the room. So it's nice and clean. I really don't have a lot to fit. It's just this. I have two pairs of shoes, one of which I'll wear at the airport, the other pair. These, so they're not like big and bulky, and my flip flops, but I feel like these don't really count as shoes because they're so slim. Outfit for the game, and then the rest of the stuff is just like various outfits I can throw together if needed. Because I don't really know what I'm gonna do the rest of the weekend. Some people might be wondering why I'm bringing home so many things because you'd think I have a second wardrobe at home, and I kind of do, but all of my like good clothes are here at school, so that's why I pack so much. Okay, did it. The bed is not made well, but I'm not late and that's what matters. All right, that's all I have for this video. Thank you guys so much for spending the week with me. I had the most amazing, relaxing, fun weekend at home. It was like everything and more. And I'm back to the grind in Colorado. So thank you guys for watching this video. I love you so much. I hope you know how loved you are and I hope you have the best day ever. Bye.